do the calculations and get it into gallons, don't I? Which is times divide by 4.45. Yes, put it in the memory. I don't know how you do that. Memory plus. Which memory is going to be fucking... Well, this is all. What did you divide the gallons by? Right, well, on YouTube. This is hopeless. 4.4... No, gallons. Right, memory plus. Memory plus. By memory plus. Five, I've done right, that. Then clear. 4.45. Clear. James. Wait a minute. What was your mileage? What? What was your mileage? Oh. <laughs> what is my mileage? This is perfect. <laughs> what is my mileage? <laughs> you were divided right. by 4.45. What's that? Why have you made me... Okay, so it's... James. Two, six. What to divide the mileage by? The, the gallons by 4.45. One, two, six, point four. Yeah. If you've got gallons. That's my mileage. Right, press the divide button. I've got litres. Which is that one. It's like a dash with a dot on it. Yes, 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 yes. And, and then, then press memory recall. Which is that one. Gallons, yes. And then press equals. Ooh. And you should have a figure. I know what it is. What to divide is by? <laughs> two, four, five. Oh. Right. Right. Hammond, as you cheated and hardly drove anywhere today. <laughs> What miles to the gallon? And he, you and he wasn't going very fast. No. Either, so. It was the fastest car know, here. So you weren't stretching your car. So it, it was faster than. It was well within its own capability. But it was faster than everybody else's car. You were cruising. I, what is the miles? 9.086. 9.1 9. miles to the gallon. Yes. James. 8.0. Go on. Is it? Go on. <laughs> Six point oh, seven. There you, there you go. There you go. Six and three quarter miles to the gallon. Yeah, they they just eat fuel. Like Six point seven five. If you'd have driven as far as us today, imagine what you'd have used. I reckon if you rub its back, it could give a really big burp. <laughs> and, and then get a slump. <laughs> I want to drive it some more. Yes, I like let's, go, and, let's go and drive. 6.75 miles to the gallon. 9.1 mine's economical as well as fast. None of us made double figures. It is actually, this is the fastest and the most economical now. Can we have some amazement, please? Wow. Wow.
<laughs> this massive boat in which there is my suitcase. Um, May. Hello. What are you doing? It's a bit awkward. What is? Well, I can't find the key fob for the keyless go thing. I had it earlier. Well, obviously you had it earlier. <laughs> You've driven it here. Well, that's what I mean. It's still in there. You sure? Well, yeah, because it's still, I can still turn it on and off, look. It's, it's, it works. So the key, it knows the key's in there? Yeah, it is. It was in, I put it on there, but at some point it's fallen off and it's gone underneath. I can't find Are you it. you sure? Yeah, well, obviously, otherwise it wouldn't have worked, would it? I'd have... I want to drink, James. I know. <laughs> but if I can't find it, I've got a lid in it. How does the door begin? Like that. Is it in the glove box? It hasn't got a glove box. I mean, it hasn't got a glove box. It doesn't, it doesn't have one. Well, what's wrong, Dennis? Looking on. No, it's, it's lots of and things it, it hasn't got. The other thing as well is why do cars <laughs> have these now? Because where do you put them when you're driving along? What's the matter with putting them into a slot in the dashboard and then turning them to start the car? Why? Why do we have this? Well, I don't. I, I don't mind having that. I do because I was to put it. Yeah, but it. It just needs a like a magnetic thing or a piece of Velcro or something. But I put it on there. Look. And I must have gone round a bend and it fell off. And I have no idea where it is. But it means I can't, I can't park it there because it's not, it won't lock. Anybody could just get in it. <laughs> but if we blocked it in with my car... Yeah, we can do there? that. You've got... Well, how do you... How do you get... Does the seat go for? Has yeah. it gone behind the seat? Well, I don't know. I, I can't see it, but you have to electrically thingy it. Well, but logically, it would have fallen down there, but I've put, you put your hand down, I've put my hand in every crevice of it, and I can't find it. This is gynaecology, this is. Sort of. It's not... Have you got a torch? Of course I haven't got a torch. Wait, Mike, I need a torch to look... This is ridiculous. Well, you have... I'm not... I'm sorry, I'm not interested in helping you anymore. I'm not, I'm not interested. Well, can you leave... Well, no, because... Can you leave me the keys to yours? Why? Well, because I'll have to park yours next, because if I can't find it... No, because you'll play a trick. I won't. I promise I won't play a trick. <laughs> well, you can block mine in. No, block this in with, with yours, yeah. People can steal from it, they just can't steal it. Can, people can... Trams can come and sleep in it, that's OK. I just don't want anybody to drive off in it. Right, so I'm going to the bar, which proves that my car is the fastest. Oh, this is beautiful. <laughs> Is he going to lift? No, he's not flat, is he? What a pathetic specimen he is. And then you, you get all the way along the main... Are you flat from there to there? Yes, I can do that. It's yeah. frightening. But it's extremely <laughs> frightening, but I can do it. No, because you just... When you come around that way, you think, well, and the aiming for that little orange... Yes, there's a piece of orange, a convenient piece of orange... Orange, which you aim for, but what you do, I find, is you get fixated on it. Yeah. And then... You, you kind of pass the corner, you think, right, I'm still aiming for the orange, aiming for the orange. Oh, my God, the corner's back there. And yeah. I'm but this, this you, can't be, you, you can't see this very well on this map, but that's a very, very slight left-hand curve. But you're doing, I don't know, 500 miles an hour by the time you get to that. And the very act of thinking about the brakes... Because just, so just to be clear, um, when you brake a car at very high speed, unless it's going in a completely straight line, it will want to swap in. So... If you're going around a corner, you've got to stay off the brakes. In fact, you've got to keep on the throttle to keep the car mm. balanced. And there is a corner there, and you have to brake while going round it, while doing, as James says, 500 miles an hour. And the other thing is that this very, very slight left curve, if you just look at this diagram, I think, well, there's a very tight left hand here, so you want to be over on the right to make but the radius of that speed. But you don't, because you're braking. So you need to be on the left, because the very act of thinking about the brakes will put you on the right anyway. If you start off on the right and start braking, you'll be off, off the page. <laughs> Hopeless. Good track, though, isn't it? It's, it's bloody fast. <laughs> That's what it's famous for. You're either going three miles an hour or 300. Can I just take a moment? Because, I don't know if you know, this, this bit was added after the the Senate accident, wasn't it? Mm. What was that like when that was one continuous bend? So you were doing 500 miles an hour and then you were expected to just go, oh, yeah, around the left-hander a bit. Mm. And still, when you've been doing 700 miles an hour. Absolutely terrifying. Yeah, no, from there to there, pre the Senate accident, must have been one of the scariest pieces of tarmac anywhere in the world. It's pretty scary anyway. 
I need to go and practice tosser. <laughs>